all right hi guys and welcome to movie mondays so this is a series that i wanted to do because um i like to watch movies and you know i've been watching some good movies i'm like yes can you can pick them okay so anyway um i just want to sh i want to share with you guys i don't know how long the series is going to run but um we're just going to roll with it okay that rooster did not just whoop anyway back to the movies so i want to share with you guys some of the stuff that i've been watching and not just movies also tv shows and just let you know what i thought and should you watch it okay so the first one is the revenant and i know this has been this is like a big movie um leonardo dicaprio can you see that Okay, that's Leonardo DiCaprio um, and this movie okay they say um, the right up in this is a frontiersman on a fur trade expedition in the 1820s fight for survival after being mauled by a bear and left for dead by members of his own hunting team okay so they're on this hunting expedition and Rooster did not just go off in my video what oh my gosh anyway so they're on this expedition um you know he gets oh my gosh the bear scene the bear scene that's all i'm gonna say because i don't want to spoil it in case you haven't seen the movie yet but i thoroughly enjoyed the movie um the bear scene oh, man i felt like i was Oh, like I was there with him and I was like, ooh, what? So, you gotta go and watch it. Um, yeah, I don't know if it's in theaters, but the movie was really great. And um, it's an action, it was categorized as adventure, drama, thriller. Um, so I think you would enjoy this. If you like drama and action, it's, it's not so much action, but you know, there's an action in it. There's some suspense because there's a bad guy and this guy is trying to like, you know, work against him, and so it has all those elements in it. And uh, I think you should watch it. Hi right, guys. So the second movie is Leap Year. I, I pulled up a better picture this time. Um, okay, so Leap Year, and this is Amy Adams and Matthew Good are starring in this, and it is a romance comedy. Um, honestly, I've kind of gotten into like a little romance comedies these days. I am normally really into thrillers and dramas. But um, you know, a little romance, a little you know, romantic comedy in your life, okay? And this particular one, I have, if I haven't watched this at least maybe six or seven times already, and that's a lot because I don't normally repeat movies. So if I watch a movie more than once, I really enjoyed it. Like even The Revenant excellent movie and i'm sure i will watch it again but i haven't watched it again yet okay because it is very it is it is a heavy movie it's not something you could probably watch every day um like the passion of christ like no um passion of the christ oh my goodness that movie was so heavy so good but also so emotionally weighted that you know, I watched it once and I to this day I haven't been able to watch it a second time just because it's so heavy um, but excellent movie and that's another one everyone should watch okay I'm um, so leapy if you're looking for a nice romantic comedy um, I really enjoy this one like I said I've seen it maybe six or seven times already and um, this is on Netflix the Revenant is not on Netflix but this one is from 2010 and um, Okay, so this is actually on Netflix. Alright guys, so my third movie pick um, for the week is Everest, okay? Now this is another fairly new one. This came out um, in September of 2015, so like about 3-4 uh, months ago. And um, excellent, excellent movie, okay? This is based on a true story which, you know, always makes it so much better. And there's an actual story behind it. Um, so, you know, it's... It, it chronicles their journey, okay? They're mountain climbers, something they can read. They have to sign here. Yeah. And I don't want to go back, but anyway, it has a bunch a bunch of big actors in it. Um, and you, oh my gosh. 
I like I say I don't want to give any you know too much away but excellent movie it has the the, the romance in it. it has the action in it, it has the the suspense in it um, but it's it's a drama it, it has it's telling a real story and um, I think it's one you have to watch okay all right guys so now it's time for TV show of the week so this is one that I just came across this week and it's called when calls the heart okay um this this series started 2014 so se uh, season two has already ended um I just found out about it like I said this week um, and I've really been enjoying it because you know how you have a lot of crap on TV I mean like a lot of garbage everything is like totally either over sexual or a bunch of cussing or just just a bunch of garbage to be on TV okay um, yeah so I found this show now be warned the first episode has a little bit of cheese okay <laughs> but um the series grew on me very quickly and then the two lead characters uh oh, what's her name on the show oh it's, that is so bad of me um they have mounty jack which is her love interest and um miss thatcher she's a teacher okay and they're in this little little coal mining town and it starts with a little walking between them but then they develop feelings for each other and I'm not going to go any further so you can watch the show okay um, but it's really nice for persons that don't want to watch a bunch of garbage you know with all this deviant um it just, just, it's just everything just garbage stuff okay I and mean, this is one you can actually watch like with the family um you can actually watch this with the family okay it's there's no profanity, no nudity, no cussing, no over sexualization of anything. It's just a nice show to watch. So, um, hey guys, that is my Monday movies, okay? I hope you enjoyed this. I will be back next week with some more pics, okay? Bye!